Hello home learners and welcome to Wednesday's math session. This week we've been learning all about money. Today we're going to look at our shop, select some things and see how many pennies we'll need to buy those objects. First object, I've got some pictures with some numbers and prices on. You could have toys with some price labels or, or just cut out some drawings and stick some price labels on them. So that would be a way to practice your numbers. So this is a lovely cream cake and it's how much? What's this number? That's right, five. So how many pennies will we need? If you don't have pennies, you could show using your fingers. That's right, five pennies. One, two, three, four, five. Let's count them out from the bowl. One, two, three, four, and five. You can touch count them to check. One, two, three, four, five. Excellent. Now let's choose another object from our lovely bakery items. Oh, let's go for this muffin. How much is on the muffin? That's right, 10 pence. We're going to put our muffin there. So can you show me 10 using your fingers? Excellent. Now let's count out some pennies to match the price. Ready? One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's touch count to, to check our answer. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Can you think of an easier way to cut to count those coins? That's right, in twos. Ready? Two, four, six, eight, ten. Excellent. Let's have one more go. This time, I'm going to choose a yummy cornflake cake. What's the number on the cornflake cake? Fantastic. Eight pence. Let's count out eight pennies. One, two, three, four, five. How many more? That's right, three more. Five, six, seven, eight. So we have five and three more. That's eight. This time, I want to see if you can use some different coins to show the price cake or biscuit. Now we've been using pennies, so if we were to have this lovely biscuit, what price is on the, on the label? That's right, 15. Now, it's going to take me a really long time to count these pennies out 15 times. What other coins could we use? Brilliant, we could use 2p coins or 5p coins. How many 5p coins will we need? Three, let's check. So we're going to count in fives. This is really tricky, ready? So it's five. And five more is 10. And five more is 15. So we've got five, 10, 15. I wonder if you could have a go at making your own shop and seeing which wonderful prices you can make with different coins. Have a go and we'll see you next time. Bye bye.